Long way home. Test. Okay, so that drops a companion cube. It fires that. Okay. So... Yeah, this is going to be an expensive bridge. Uh, let's see. Probably hook this up. So no matter what, I cannot block any of these. If I do, whole thing breaks in unfortunate ways. Can I move this over by one? No. Gonna move it over by one so it's stable. There it goes. That is not proper road placement. Okay, so it's it sags a bit, but it looks like it's damn stable. Which is all we needed. Can I hook this up? I can. Okay, cool. Let me see. Can I hook these up here? I can. Let's get rid of this. Does that hook up? Cool. Yeah, the, the less parts we use, the better. Saves me a lot of trouble. And hangs. It's probably going to swing, though, when something hits it. Which is, of course, going to be a problem. I mean, ultimately, I'm going to hook up all of these bridges together. Let me see. Any of these that, like... Hook up well. Answer is nothing immediately. Okay, that's a little bit more useful. I'm just going to put pieces down in kind of places that they will connect. And then shift them. Because what I'm going to have to do is effectively make kind of a ramp system. Maybe ramp system isn't the right word. But it is going to have to uh, kind of like, they're going to have to climb this. And that's going to be very, very uncomfortable. Uh, let's see. So what I should probably do is actually start moving them up. Like, every time they reach one of these, they should ascend. Long road home, home indeed. Cripes. Uh, let's see. So we probably need, like, a, a lower platform here. Probably don't need to drop this that much. Can I extend this up? You know, I can probably extend extend that there. I don't think we need as much on this end. Heck, I don't even know if we need that much on that end. Uh, let's see. 
instead of adding weird redundant systems. Let's try and minimalize the, the amount of parts that I use. Uh, let's see. Here. This is reasonable. I actually don't know much about good bridge construction, technically. I should probably learn, seeing as I keep playing these games. Because I'm sure, I'm sure I would actually be able to learn some fairly useful bits of information and tips and whatnot. But that takes work. Okay, so that sags real hard. Well, when in doubt, this is what the cables are for. Anyway. Gotta spread that load somehow. See, so these these points can't can't all hang. But some of them can. And the more cable cables I use, the better. Okay, you're good. You're good, you're already connected, and the rest of these are already good. Okay, test. Okay, significantly less saggage now. That's good, especially because I'm actually going to have to, uh... uh... Uh, okay. Well, here's the thing. This actually doesn't need to be nearly as low. Okay, let's try that. You went to engineering school, and the statistics course I took had all the bridge building stuff in it. Statistics? I'm surprised it would be statistics of all things. Okay, so I'm gonna drop this down. Yeah, that's... Already got a cable holding it together, but I'll add another one. Alright, let's try that again. Let's see. Okay, that worked perfectly. Now, he does actually hit that... He does actually hit that button fairly well. And then after that, it becomes hell. Because they have to hit this button, otherwise they can't leave. Oh, statics, not to statistics. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. I was like, statistics? I'm, I'm not going to question it, but I'm going to be very confused. Okay, well, I'm more or less just going to have to extend this down. Nice part is, this does give my bridge a foot. It's an awkward and maybe not the most useful... bridge, but it does give it a foot. Test. Okay, stable. Which is surprising. Well, no, it's not that surprising. Mostly just surprising because this is only connected by like one little section here. I'll reinforce. Okay, cool. So now that we've got a foot, we effectively want to slowly build it back up to here. Kind of move this down. I... Yeah, the reason why I want to kind of dip this in a little bit is so it's not this, like, weird thing. Uh, let's see. And then I think I'm going to just put shifty feet for this bridge. 
on every one of these like little pillars. This is probably going to be the most expensive bridge I, I build to date. I mean, we're already nearing on... We're already nearing nearing the... The most expensive point. Can I shift this over? Cool. Okay, so next up... Here. Nice part is feet don't have to uh feet don't actually have to be physical. They just kind of have to brace. It slides a little bit. That's why I need to kind of sort of distribute the weight. Uh, more feet will uh will distribute it the way I need it to. Yeah, it slides a bit, but that's not a problem. See, those aren't static buttons. They need constant pressure. Uh... Oh! Hold on. I see why it it's m m messed up in my head. I never actually bothered to get this thing to connect. I thought I was supposed to hit this button once. I didn't even notice the companion cube here. Well, you know what? Uh, I guess all of my talk of shifty shifty bridge feet uh, can go out the window a little bit. Uh, let's see. Can I... I guess all I have to do is just figure out the proper angling here. Let's just do test. And then I'll, I'll figure out the rest. Luckily I can just hang this. But this is going to shoot down and hopefully if I can angle it in here, we're golden. And then I'll just run this along the side or something. No, that would be too shallow. Part of the problem is it, uh, it drops. My, my bridge is very, um, saggy. Okay, there we go. That one cable is actually very stressed. Eh, should be fine. Yeah. You know, that is actually a really funny idea. Uh, I bet that first one would have bounced off the button and hit the receiver. You mean bounce, uh, firing this to hit this one over here? I could have actually done that. That would be really amusing. I don't, I don't know if it would work. But that would actually be really funny to bypass this whole thing. By, uh... Let's see. Now that's probably fine. I can't move that too much. Maybe there? Yeah, this is why I need trajectory, like trajectory measurements or something. Okay, so that hits there, this hits there. If, uh, if this ends up being too much work, I will try firing this over here. Alright, that should work? Nope, doesn't. Alright, screw it. So, uh, save construction, slot one. All right. Now let's start deleting the pat. Um, you know what? Maybe let's not delete the pathway. I'll delete this because it looks bad and I feel bad. Okay. 
Delete this here. Let's get rid of a lot of these these dirty cables. Okay. Let's start cheating flagrantly. People don't like it when I cheat. But today, I cheat. Shh. I know it looks awful. But that's not a high priority right now. Okay, so now we end up with this really long, complicated pseudo bridge thing. Should be fine. Can I? Yeah, I can hook this up. We don't. We don't need this here. Yeah, that was that was okay for a moment. This part not so okay. It really needs better snapping. Just slightly better. Doesn't need much. Okay. So, this is gonna fall. You know, do I even need this? I don't know if I do. We just need feet. Though I might have to rope them together. We're also going to need a lower layer. Hmm. Okay. Because here's the thing. This bridge is going to need, like, a connector. Because effectively, what I'm going to do is swing... Swing down, grab it, and then pull it up as close as I can... To the previous bridge. The main problem is we still have to drop this. Because that, that cube, no matter what, has to be dropped down. But then after that, it's, uh, then after that, it's smooth sailing. So this drops. Uh, let's see, can I? Move this. Just a smidge. Wow. That's really picky. Uh, let's see. Can I move you over a bit? Move. Can't move this up. But there we go. Okay. Now it, that, uh, now it connects. It was really fighting me there. Uh, let's see. And no matter what, this is going to fight me. This ain't stable. Let's see, can I... I guess I can do this? I still really wish I could middle click to connect everything. Because no matter what, this is still going to be kind of a shaky system. Okay, well, that connects. This is here. I guess this can be the start of the actual bridge up. Gotta remember to actually connect these. Yeah, I don't know if these, like, five-point systems are particularly strong. I don't think they are. I think they've always been a little garbage. Okay. And then, yeah, from here, all we need to do is just kind of run the road all the way to the end. And then, you know, get the get the thing to work. It's very saggy on this side. What if I do something like this? Kind of like a claw foot. Going on. 
Because maybe it'll be less, uh... Maybe it'll be less, uh, sketchy if it's, if it's, like, firmly hooked together. Well, that didn't work. Okay, can I drag you up? I can drag you up. Yeah, so the moment the weight hit it... Okay, there we go. So by, by capping that little pillar, it is holding on by its toes. Uh, by capping that little pillar, we... We are able to, um, to hold on despite the, uh, despite the, the forces arrayed against it. Okay, and it looks like I can't... Yeah, I can't cross this thing. So I can't put a good foot on this. But I can sure as hell put a really bad foot on it. The only problem is going to be uh, figuring out the exact... Uh, figuring out the exact angle. Okay. That's a little... If you probably because I never connected these, it was like free float ish. Oh, look at that horror! Okay, so if I just turn that in, let's see if that works. No, way, way too, too steep of an angle. I'm just gonna try and use this this beam. Now that ain't gonna work. What about this one? Okay, that's actually really promising. And if all I all I have to do is just tip it up just a little bit. Then we're good. And I can use this opportunity to add yet another foot. More feet! This bridge has a problem. Okay, so add that there. Okay, so for lucky... This will just kind of guide it in. Oh, that saggage worries me. Well, that's fine. The plasma la lasts longer than you thought it would. It's, uh, bizarrely long. Unfortunately, too low. Just gonna have to rely on that. I don't entirely know what this is gonna do, but if I could... Like, all it has to do is just bounce awkwardly around here until it hits the thing. This bridge is a monster. Yes, it is. Perfect. Okay, so that's all I needed. That's all I needed. So let's just continue this stupid shit. Uh, I have... Okay, we will just barely cross 300,000 on this one. It looks like. But hey, that's all you need. Oh, I see. There we go. That should work. It doesn't sag too much. Uh, <laughs> oh god. Can you imagine driving up to this in real life? I thought price doesn't matter. Oh no, it doesn't. It's just, uh... You know, I like to kind of keep track of how much I'm spending. Oh, that was closer than I thought it was going to be.
Alright, and we're done. If we want it to be as expensive as possible. I will admit it's a secret side goal of this entire thing to make the most expensive bridge possible. Alright, so let's see if it at all fails. If we're... I mean, so far it's so good. Uh, so far so good. That initial jump is worrying. Let's see, Wonder, have you heard about uh, Trail Makers? I have. Durf gave me a key for it. Uh, unfortunately, I've been really busy, so I haven't had any time to spare thinking about it. However, uh, as soon as I get back from vacation, it'll probably be one of the main things I think about. At least as far as, like, multiplayer shenanigans go. Well, that was really easy. I think shower curtains would probably make this a lot cheaper. Oh, yeah, probably. But, like, whatever. You are now recognized as full Chief Custodian Candidate. We will continue to monitor your progress in this final testing series to ensure that any mental damage is attributed to your persistence. Fifty-one. Balanced. Toy! Okay. Oh. Um... Okay. So I'm supposed to balance this thing in here without touching the blue? Or the, uh... Without touching the blue? Or the acid or the red or anything? Test. Shit. <laughs> yes. Oh. What? Oh. Okay, then. Um. Wait. Hold on. I can't build through this, can I? Nope. Huh. Huh. Hmm. Okay. So this is just me. So effectively, I actually have to give a shit about weights and stuff. Let me let you in on a, on a little secret about me. Giving a shit about weights is hard. I... This is just fiddly. Well, I mean, when in doubt, just make it fat. And then just accept that it's bad. 
Look, I got low standards. Okay, test. It immediately just kind of drops. Yeah, I figured. Uh, let's see. So we have to make sure we have enough weight on this side to prevent it from doing too much test without just dropping on me. I... Hmm. Let's see. Wander, does this mean you go to gyms? I... Sometimes. I have a gym as part of my apartment complex. I don't go as often as I should. I'm not, like, grossly overweight. But it is one of those where I would love to lose more weight if I, you know, had the time. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, the biggest problem is it looks like I need some kind of, like... Structural support from both directions. Because it just drops. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. We've got a bridge to build. Okay, so here's the thing. I just realized about this thing. One, it goes all the way up here. Now, you may be thinking to yourself, what the hell? Like that's that's just that's just out of bounds, dude. Don't don't go there. But you need to curb those thoughts because you're wrong. You are very grossly misinformed about the uh the capabilities of being outside right now. So all I have to do is say, mm, I don't, I don't, I don't care for your cheap tricks or your, or your rules or your homework. God, am I glad I don't have to do homework anymore. Okay, so here's the thing. I don't care about low scores or any, any of that that stuff that kind of gives me a lot of a lot of room, room to build around here i was gonna try and do uh quick and dirty but it looked like uh well it looks like quick and dirty is is a, a no-go situation here uh, let's see so instead we're just going to uh cheese it all hook that up Oh my god. Is this this is probably going to not work. Who knows? But at the same time, now that worked. I mean it it's a little much, but this just has to kind of stick together for a little while. Here's the main problem, though. Getting over here is going to take some doing. <sighs> really now. Okay. So all we have to do is just hook this up right. Okay. So what this does is gives me a a big upper area that I can more or less just oh, sit up in my chair. Okay. So here's the problem. Trying to get something to balance in here just sucks. It's not very fun. So what we're going to do is we're just going to do the ultra reach around. I know what I said. And uh, put a put a foot here. Kind of keep this whole thing together. 
And then we want to put like one of these right here. Oh, this shouldn't work. But I think it's going to. Okay. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, there's there's no point in uh, having it be so steep there. Uh, let's see. Probably like that. Okay. So I think... I think by doing this, I can put some ramps right here. Test. Okay, too far, actually. Still too far. I'm surprised. Alright, there we go. Drive. <laughs> wow. Um Wow. 